As we reported the other day, Fox Studios is looking to bring another Wolverine film to the big screen with the success of this summer's The Wolverine. The latest film made well over $400 million at the box office, and director James Mangold and star Hugh Jackman are in talks to return. Jackman was recently asked about where a new Wolverine film could go, which he said the following. I was on the phone with Jim Mangold last night. There are some really cool ideas that I'm dying to tell you, but that would be giving away a secret that is not even fully formed yet. Dennis, buy or sell that we'll actually see another Wolverine movie. Oh, definitely buy it. I mean, all the stars are aligned. You had a movie that made money, that has a popular character, and now you have the director and, most importantly, Hugh Jackman wanting to come back and do it. So, yeah, we're going to see another one. I think. It didn't make as much money as the last one, but I think it was hurt by the quality of the last one. Oh, absolutely. One. And that's why, because I, I really yeah. like this one, and I thought it was a, a definite, a very big improvement over the last one. So I, I, I hope that the same team comes back for it. Yeah, I'm going to buy this too. And it's funny because, you know, a couple of months ago, I was thinking, you know what? I'm wondering if X-Men Days of Future Past, we heard some comments from you, Jackman, I'm wondering if X-Men Days of Future Past will be the last time we see Hugh Jackman as Wolverine. He has served us well for like 15 years as the character, and he has to give up so much of his life doing nothing but working out to look like this, right. constantly on the phone with The Rock to say, what else do I got to do to make my calves bigger? You right. know? So, but you know, it sounds like he's open to it. It sounds like he's excited about it. I'm sure that the new one making $400 million at the box office, which I, I know Fox was a little bit nervous about because of the quality of the last one, which was not very good. But this one was, was a big improvement. Uh, you know, once again, I could have done without the last 20 minutes of the film, and they really botched that whole ninja fight scene. But other than that, I thought it was a really quality film. He's getting better and better and better as Wolverine. Yeah, so for me, overall, it's a buy, Schnepp. I got to buy and sell it, because I buy that. If you Jackman's coming back as Wolverine, I buy it. I just was, like, mixed on, that, on the Wolverine. I felt that that ending really soured it for me, and right. it was very uneven. There were parts of the Wolverine that I really loved, and a lot that I didn't love. I mean, it, it was heads and tails above the Wolverine Origins movie, but still, this one was, you know, ultimately when I looked at the, the past, this past summer and all the different superhero films, that one's like in the middle. Like, I didn't hate it, but I also didn't love it. So to hear that that same team is back, I'd rather see a different director go with Hugh Jackman. But once again, it's also the script, you know, there's a lot of script problems. That last half of the Wolverine movie just fell apart and became a different movie, a kind of a goofy movie. Mm. And it, so, you know, with that being said, I'll buy it, but, you know, I just want a better script. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to AMC Movie News on YouTube. It's free and a great way to stay updated with all the latest movie news and check out our daily show, AMC Movie Talk. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter to stay in the loop for our special prizes, giveaways, and contests.